Hello guys over here, so I'm a gang really quickly. I'm back with the episode 2 of Maker on Five Nights at Freddy's fan game in Clip Team Fusion. And so let's open up our Clip Team Fusion. So first I'm gonna be uh, looking where I've saved the file because I, I I don't know where, where, where I've saved the file myself. So I think the file that I've saved is, uh, is somewhere around here, so I'm just gonna open the file. Uh, yeah, this is the main file, I think. I think that's the file I have saved. Yeah, so in the previous tutorial, we have done up to this. Uh, as you can see, no. So in the previous tutorial, we have done up to this, like that, you can see. And yeah. So, it's again, double click on application one tutorial, now click on three, and name it as Night One Stars. And double click on the uh, night one starts tab and again in the tab just uh, right click insert object and again insert the active object here now once you inserted the active object now in the active object uh, uh, don't do anything just uh, click on the uh, background uh, I mean don't, click on the night one starts and go down in uh, go down and you can see background color uh, select the background color to black here and once the background color is black make an active object and double click on your active object and make uh, the f and uh, import the file that says uh, 2 a.m. first night like that so I think that should be in the nights the night start and ends yeah this is what I'm is looking for 2 a.m. first night it will be in that is okay and then just uh, like the previous one select the uh, fill in with color tool and fill with the black color in there fill the black color and um, yeah there we have it hit ok and uh, what you can do is uh, right click it and go to align in frame horizontal center so what that does that it keeps this text right into the center yeah, and see it's just right in the center. Pretty cool, huh? Yeah. Now you wanna add an animation, right? So to add an animation, right click on it, click on insert object and insert an active object here. Double click on the active object and then import and now import the animation file. So this animation file is here is a white thingy. Here's the animation file, so I'm going to be using these three files, not uh, more. So, uh, new frame, alright, and this one, okay. Uh, new frame, insert. I'm sorry for the background noise, noises of that. Uh, that, yeah. Okay, now, hit. Now, once you've done that, uh, let me change the speed to 80 and then hit OK. Now make that again to fit to the frame as we do it's the other one. Again, make it to fit to the frame, and uh, just cl click on the uh, new one uh, that that you make it to fit to the frame. Just click on it that, and then just uh, click on the um, click on the yeah, click on the window this one over here. Go down. You can see the blend soft sand. Now change it to. 150. So what that does, it actually is it, it actually shows that may making it like look like a saddle. Yes. So now when you just run the frame, oh no, that wasn't supposed to happen. Yeah. Uh, again, uh, just right click, edit it, and while editing, what you can do is go to direct direction options and hit it to repeat five times, and uh, just it, it, it should look look like this. Here. yeah that hit okay yeah so when, once it's done and that uh, when you run the frame you can see it, it does that but it, but it, unfortunately you can see that this animation does not go so to fix it go to event editor click on new condition right click this one and hit start a frame now again go to new condition 
uh, right click in uh, where, where your uh, the animation file is mine is here because it's so it, it, it will be invisible because it depends on your color mine is uh, white so it's invisible so right click on it and go to animation has an animation finished it stopped so now uh, animation stop is over go right down this uh, right click visibility invisible so what that does yeah you can see that actually stops it right when it's done yeah so that is going to be pretty good and uh, next thing we are going to add is um, the transitions uh, that shows while this frame so to do that uh, double click on the uh, um, application one and then click on this one this uh, the fade uh, in and then just um, select the transition to fade and yeah, change the duration to 1 second 58 or a millisecond or something whatever you like but the best one uh, that I prefer to do is the 1 second 35 1 so you, you can just use the arrow keys to do it anything you like hit ok and what that does is when you just run the frame so when you click on new game button Yo, you can see that actually fares like uh, a professional thing. And now you want to add an static here that shows like in the or original game. So, to do that, uh, you will also need your st static file. So, just go to find that uh, right click, uh, not edit, right click, insert object, insert active object. So, that is going to be like uh, what we do in the first night one. So, insert the uh, uh, animation here this deep static uh, open state import as animation hit ok so it will import as an animation of two five six and and there is going to be uh, there is a very important uh, tip you have to do is when you go to direction options make sure so that it is looped and make sure that hundred is sorry the speed is hundred it's really important to do so now when you play it you can see it's like the static you know like uh, you know like uh, on that TVs you know televisions uh, when there is no uh, supply of uh, uh, cables that happen that that same like that hit ok again make it to fit to the frame so here so so what you you will find one thing is when you run the application you can see that the static blocks the uh, box your uh, title screen image and all your five nights and Freddy's text so to avoid it just click on your application the static one go to the window this one over here now go down and then uh, you can see blend coefficient set it to 400 yeah now 400 set it to 450 so yeah that does very well so you can see it's very good and now when you run the application yeah you can see the static being held in the backward and now when you just run the game it jumps to this one help wonder pretty fast very pizza but you will again find a slight problem that you can see uh, when you uh, open run the application and click on new game button the newspaper tab will not go to the a uh, night uh, one uh, screen so the way that i have uh, so, so the way i have to fix it is just uh, go to your article and go to your event editor again new condition right click this storyboard controls start a frame you have to do it always while doing anything now click on new condition so now here what you want to do is uh, um just uh, right to, no 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 yeah, go to uh, no 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 go uh, in the star frame. Uh, you can see here the active. No no yeah. So just click on new condition. Right click on this timer. Now here every. Now in every. Uh, so about in every uh, five seconds. Go down storyboard controls next frame. So in every five seconds that will jump to next frame. I will show you right now here. Uh, so when you click on new game, it's here. Now after five seconds, one, two, three, four, five.
it jumps to this frame with the animation thing over here. And uh, you can again go to application one, click on this fade out, and make the transition to fade, and make the duration to uh, 1 second 58, and hit OK. And uh, let's run our whole application here now. Here, new game. Hello, pointed. Freddy Fazbear's Pizza. Family Pizza. You're looking for security guard to work the nice safe motor cameras, insure safe review cameras, and animatronic registers. Yeah, so it jumps to this frame over here. I got uh, the uh, you know advanced one yeah and this much uh, I think is good for your for this uh, application uh, for this episode thanks for watching I hope uh, you enjoy the tutorial this may be a bit fast but uh, um, I have you, you can learn everything and if there's a slight problem then I'm ready ready to remake it so uh, um, just uh, tell me how you like the tutorial in the comments below and by the way stay tuned for episode 3 in the office scrolling to